What is the best SD card for your DJI Mavic 3? Recording video requires a constant minimum write speed to prevent interruption of the data that's being transferred. Picking a SD card that is fast enough is especially important for the Mavic 3 as the bandwidth has increased to a whopping 200 megabit per second when recording in H.264 or H.265 at the maximum resolution. This is for easy comparison more than five times faster than the original Mavic Mini. So the SD cards that you already have purchased that might work well with your older drones that does not necessarily work equally well with the newer generation of drones, especially with the Mavic 3. If you attempt to use an SD card that is too slow, you will see that the recording will stop very frequently as the stream is not able to keep up. Before you get to that point, you might even see warnings pop up on your DJI Fly app that will tell you that the SD card is simply not fast enough. Regardless how this pans up, you need to retire those old SD cards and upgrade to new ones that are capable of handling the higher speeds. It's simply not worth risking getting the money shot when you're out in the field filming because of slow SD cards. The SD Card Association has defined various speed classes that will help us consumers to pick the right card for quality video recordings. By labeling the product with a symbol and a number that indicates the minimum reliable write speed, it's very easy for us to pick the right card for our needs. There are three kind of speed indicators covering the need from 720p to 8K video. And the three indicators are speed class, is UHS speed class and then it's video speed class. On most cards, you will find all three speed classes, which is kind of redundant information. Some cards are also labeled with A1 and A2. This is related to application performance, where the SD card is fast enough to expand the memory of, let's say, a smartphone. This information is super nice, but not necessarily relevant to video recording. So how do you pick the right one? We know that the Mavic 3 is capable of writing up to 200 megabit per second recording in max resolution. So to make it easy for you, I have have made a chart based on the information from the SD Association and added the minimum write speed, making it very easy for you to determine what card that you need. As you can see, you need a U3 or V30 to be able to handle the stream from the Mavic 3. I have for your convenience included links in the description below for some cards that I've used in the past that I know will work flawlessly with the Mavic 3. You can also use the chart that I've made to pick out SD cards for some of your other drones in case that you don't know what to purchase. So this video might be a nice reference for you in the future when you need to pick out any SD card. Also, I made a PDF with the table that you can download through the Tech Drone Media website through a link in the description below in case that you like to have this kind of information in writing. If you don't care about the price, you can just use some of the cards that are listed on the GGI website under the Mavic 3 FAQ section. I hope you liked this video. If you did, then feel free to give a like. If you didn't like it, feel free to press the dislike button twice. Thank you for watching and I'll be seeing you around.